Hello, hello, hola. Ciao and bonjour. It's time for the Miku Zone, not the Iono Zone. That's that's a that's a different video game. All right, hello gamers. It is time to fight. I think this is supposed to be the Elite Four. But I think I think Galar went. We have the Elite Four at home, and then and then they just made you fight the gym leaders again. <laughs> Maybe Larry is not as special as we thought Larry was. Alright, he's the Champion Cup time. Time for Champion Cup. It's, we're still in the same area. With, with the Champion Cup in it today. Uh, let, me, let me remind myself what was going on last time. Can't spend money. Okay, good. Don't, don't. Save. Save your money. Hello, gamers. Hello, Lily. Um, okay, we're fighting Nessa, which means I should not have Rotom Heat on my team. I do not want to bring the heat. What? Why do I? Uh-oh. Okay, what, what do we want to make Rotom for this? Hello, Hayden. Uh, how am I today? I'm, I'm tired. Oh, I didn't sleep well. I kept waking up throughout the night. Um, let's see. Be, be, before I forget, what, what are we gonna make a Rotom be? To be helpful. Um, maybe just light bulb. But then we have ghost weakness. Uh, she likes to use dark types. Well, with a washi machine. Fight, <laughs> fight water with water. I think I might go fight water with water. Oh, lawnmower. We have grass type. Wait, that cuts the grass. Why is why is lawnmower? You know, I'm not gonna question it. We're just gonna we're just gonna do the thing. Okay, let's see how it goes. The rumbling. What is what does the rumbling have to do with? Are we the rumbling? Fight water with grass electric. Yes, that that is a great idea. Uh, so plan for today is fight fight the four gym leaders, and then we'll have. Oh no! There's a reason why he wasn't. Set. We're fighting Beady first. <laughs> Dang it! We're fighting Beady first. He has no BD. We'll be fine. This is why we had it as Rotom Heat. So we could switch out and then like burn. Wait, no, no. No, no. Hold on. Use this catalog. And then we're going to make him the microwave oven. Then we know overheat, and th and then we're gonna fight, and then we're gonna be like, oh look, you're up against Nessa first. Never mind, it's actually BD. What if humans live in Splatoon three? That is an excellent question. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if humans do exist somewhere. We just don't know about it. Give me like, thank you. Leon points at screen. Hello, you're going to eat a banana. Um, as long as it's not from Atropius, I think we're good. If it is from Atropius, I don't know how Pokemon Osha would feel about that. <laughs> Do people eat the bananas? Because there is, there is, there is Nana berries, right? It's supposed to be like bananas. But they don't come from Tropius, they just grow on normal berry trees. Hmm. It is from Tropius, or whoever is- oh no! I don't know how legal that is. You still have some dodo, do I- no! 
All human make loud noise. Uh oh. That how they feed the inklings, they make loud noises. Not legal at all. Oh no, they're just dodos, then tropius bananas. You guys are concerning me. So I forget how many how much text there is here. This is supposed to be like BD's redemption arc or something like that. Like look at me, I'm a reformed BD now. I'm no longer evil. I am king. Whatever that's supposed to be. <laughs> okay, so we cannot switch out on the first turn. But we are gonna switch out into Rotom. Do you play Roblox? No. No, I do not. I do not play Roblox. Um. Oh, right. I have to use random number generator. Hold on. Random <laughs> number between one and three. Number three. Thank you. Thank you, random number generator, for, for picking the one move that will literally do nothing. Okay. Now we can switch out. And now we can switch out into... This is the only one we have that can actually hit. Uh-oh. He does have fight in his eyes now. Oh, he does have light in his eyes. Yeah, he's got that. He's got that glimmer of hope. All right, random number generator between one and three. One. <laughs> okay, it's only the first move though. Afterwards, we we can actually hit it now with overheat. Okay, overheat. Now out dead. Now what then? Now he's got basically three Pokemon that are all Psychic Fairy type. Um, how how am I gonna defeat three Psychic Fairies? Cause they're weak to Steel and Poison and Ghost. They're weak to Ghost. Wait, we have Ghost. A Rotom is Ghost. What well, has it has Hex? He's not he's not ghost but it has ghost um now polka's gonna die i sent polka out polka dead um ooh, poison oh this is <laughs> this is dumb so basically R rotom can sweep here but because i used overheat our special attack is lowered so i need to <laughs> switch out <laughs> I think this is the safest switch out. We need to switch out to reset all the stat losses we just got. Do I like the champion Diantha? She's like the one I remember the least of. I don't even remember what she did. Like I remember her design. It's like, oh, she's just... She's just a white Cynthia. <laughs> I don't know. Random number generator. Number two. Uh... No, I'm not. I'm not gonna eat Dodo. I'm good. The risk is too great. Um. Hey, Gardevoir, speed is down. Hello, Akos. Okay, so they they just had a wish to heal themselves. I'm gonna heal my own Pokemon and then I'll switch in. Oh, I should have bought more potions. Now we're good. We're good. We're fine. We're safe. The problem is I won't be able to use Rotom in the next gym battle. The other problem is she's setting up Calm Mind. Hold on. Is, is BD gonna like destroy us? What am I doing for the curse again? I'm hopefully it'll be done next week. I'm editing the video right now um, It's just taking a bit longer than expected and by a bit longer. I mean two weeks longer than expected. I want to have this out like last week And then I was like, oh, I'm gonna finish it this week And I, st I still haven't finished <laughs> All right hex kill it <laughs> It's set up way too much
I don't like this. I don't like what he's doing right there. Basically, if he tries to attack at this point, he just one-shots everything. You can't let his Gardevoir set up, essentially. I'm just gonna hope he keeps setting up. And then we'll, we'll hit him with the Poison Jab. Yeah, we still have the Toxtricity. Watch him just attack right now and make us... Yep. Yep, we're reset. <laughs> we're not even gonna watch that move land. Because I already know exactly what's gonna happen. I already know exactly what's gonna happen. So Gardevoir is gonna be a problem. Because it sets up. And even after being hit with Icy Wind once, it's still too fast. For Toxtricity. And I did not save before walking in. Um, let's see, can I, can I take Toxtricity out? Can I take him out of the party? Like, what, what are our options here? Um, okay, so Lapras is not usable. I have these two, they're, hmm. <clears throat> Yeah, they're, they're, they're both weak to steel, which is why I'm not bringing them in. Okay. So basically, we need to switch to Rotom. I, and BD might be the one that ends this run then. Because I'm trying to think, like, how do we... How do we beat him? Right, because we, we have to switch in on the first one. But maybe I don't have to use Rotom to defeat him? Hey. Right. I, I do I do still have the Toxtricity, yes. But I, w I wish there was like a skip cutscene option, because we already watched this fight. Give us a clue to the new Pald Anchors? Um... Psyduck. That's it. That's the... That's the clue. Okay. There's no... There's literally no skip button. I'm, I, I have to watch this every time. Means I have to big brain it so we don't have to reset again. <laughs> uh Okay. So Manwai was not a problem. Gardevoir and Hatterene both know Combine. So neither of those can really be allowed to stack up much. Gardevoir is pretty fast as well. Like really fast. I mean, not that fast, but like it's got 80 speed. Hatterene, we're not gonna have to worry about its speed. Gardevoir, we do have to worry about its speed. Okay. Who's my favorite champion? Um, probably Steven Stone. He's cool because he likes he likes stones. <laughs> yeah, Hatterene's very slow. But it's, it's basically the Gardevoir build, but on Hatterene. So he essentially just has two Gardevoirs. Okay. So we're gonna we're gonna random number generate. No, this time we get number one. Okay, so we actually are gonna get to do some damage this time. Okay, so from now on we're gonna Okay, we're gonna hit with discharge. Part of me wants to stay on field, but I feel like I feel like Gardevoir Psychic is gonna knock me out. Right, because like th this thing is strong against Gardevoir.
Why remove one curse or donate one million? No. Neither. Okay, gonna use crunch. Good morning, Matthew. Alright, random number generator. Please do not be overheat. Okay. Number two. Discharge. Not overheat. We can work with this. Okay. So next up, he's gonna follow up with Gardevoir. And we're just gonna... Oh, I can't even spam Hex because I have to use different moves every turn. Okay, that, that was good though. It took half its HP. Um, as long as he doesn't attack, I think we can manage to take him down. Gotta go. Alright, have a good day. Alright, we're gonna hit him with a discharge. Okay, oh, wonderful. Wonderful, that got rid of Gardevoir. Alright, next up he's got Rapidash and we can use Hex again. Your mochi mochi song. Yeah, we can, yeah, I can do dad jokes again. How's this? Every time I have to reset, I do a dad joke. And since I reset once, let's see. Um, these are horrible dad jokes. I'm gonna look for other dad jokes. <laughs> but what if I? Oh, there's a Twitter for dad jokes. Uh. These are all bad. <laughs> I don't. I don't think these are funny to read out loud. Um, I'm gonna drop my heel here, just cause I. I don't want. I don't want to die. I don't want to risk of the death, you know. There's non-horrible. I know. There's. There's. There's some bad jokes that aren't too bad. I mean, well, we all know that 6 is afraid of 7 because 7, 8, 9. But 7 was scared of 2 for 6, 8, 10. Get it? It's, it's, it's such a, it's such a non-joke. I don't know. I'm not feeling it. Mr. Krabs. <laughs> the last thing also has, like, dazzling green. Yeah. It has Psychic, that's the real problem. But I kind of need to switch out because th this Rotom is going to get microwaved. What do I switch out into though? This will die. This will die. Uh, that's a bird. This would This would die. <laughs> Hmm. I mean, this is my best option. Because we also need to, like, bulk through the three turns of Dynamax. I mean, I could attack through them, but, like, it's got double HP, so I might as well wait for them to be over. Sacrifice the bird. But... But it's a bird. Oh, the bird lover. Yeah, maybe, maybe Reddit has some good bad jokes. I, oh my gosh. I'm literally gonna have to heal through all three turns. <laughs> the battlefield got weird. Yeah, yeah, it did. Oh no. 
if you want to put on extra muscle in your lower legs, make sure you drink milk. It's been shown to be the best thing for growing calves. Because calves are baby cows and also your muscles with the lower leg. Sacrificing bird means getting chicken. I want to get chicken. So hi Brian, how are you doing? We have finally Now here's the problem <laughs> The more I look at this the more depressed I get I need to be able to switch into this thing before it sets up Actually, there, there's a chance that monkey lives. There's a chance that monkey lives. There's a chance. Okay, okay, okay. She used Dazzling Gleam. <laughs> the monkey's gonna die! It's gonna die, there's... How do I... I'm gonna have to sacrifice someone here. <laughs> Hey, how do how do how how do I do this? This thing has a much stronger special attack than Gardevoir. It's ba okay, basically it's gonna use Mystical Fire. So knows Mystical Fire dazzling. So knows Mystical Fire, which will kill Monkey. It knows Dazzling Gleam. Which will kill this and the bird. And then also no psychic, which will kill this thing. So realistically, we only have two Pokemon that won't get like one shot. But both of them have like a quarter of their HP left. I mean, I'm not using this bird that much. <laughs> I'm not. I think I think we're gonna have to we're gonna have to. I I just I can't think of another way around. Okay, goes for the psychic. Yeah, uh, oh, we're we're taking too much damage. I have an idea. It's called surrender. We're not gonna surrender, hi George, but we are gonna sacrifice the bird. We are we are going to have to sacrifice the bird. Which is rather unfortunate, but Well I could I could have tried to attack, but since the first move a Pokemon uses in battle has to be RNG, there's only a one in three chance I'd get U-turn. See with Roll Time we've already used their one RNG move. So I can I can just I can just hit Hex, and we can just kill it. Oh, my hand slip? No, there is no hand slipping. Are you gonna use Psychic? Don't, don't do a lot of damage. Oh my gosh. We're gonna have to hope that Discharge knocks it out. Because if Discharge doesn't knock it out, we're gonna lose Roll Town too. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, thank heck and goodness. We can't use the oven in the Nessa fight now. <laughs> oh, gosh. We learned Leaf Blade! Yay! This is me. No, there's no other way to beat him. Like, it's just... He, he just counters everything. Sometimes we gotta sacrifice, you know? When there's no other way around, we have to do the sacrifice. Just got here, what'd you miss? Uh, <laughs> we lost the Pokemon. Good thing I went with Discharge and not that Charge. Yep, yep. This, this was Dad Joke Central? Come on. Okay. 
now he's like, oh, it's finals time. Well, it is not finals time. We gotta go. We gotta go sell our potion. Sell our potions. And and bench the bird permanently. And bench the Rotom. Oh, everything's dead. I like it. I mean, Rotom's not dead. It's just not on the usable list. And then, and then the bird is just permanently unusable now. Okay. So for Nessa... Shoot, the dinosaur is weak! <laughs> He's gonna... I mean, we have freeze dry, right? We have freeze dry. <laughs> but freeze dry is... <laughs> we gotta be fast enough to actually hit the things. Otherwise, it's a rock type and we're gonna get one shot. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> I think I, I mean, we have to like. Uh, yeah, it, it's gonna be what Lapras and Wiggly. Huh? Sacrifice the dinosaurs? No! No! Okay, um, uh, get a move. Good, we're good. Oh. Okay. Which move should we forget? I think we're gonna forget knockoff. Doesn't I? Oh, you make a good point. Does it? Because if it does, then I'm, I might as might bring it for real, for real. I'm gonna check, hold on. Oh, Aurorus? Aurorus. Let's see. Nope, it takes double damage from water. <laughs> Sadly, not resistant. Um, okay, anyone else with four moves you need to get rid of? No. Okay. Well. And now we gotta sell our potions again. Oh, I'm not. I'm not here to buy it. I'm here to sell first. Sell first, buy later. To buy four restores. Anyways, good sir. Can I buy some full restores for? You? I hate this. Song. I don't think NASA really does status effect, so I'm only gonna buy two full restores. And then, like, three max potions. And then... I'm gonna regret it, so I'm gonna buy two more max potions. Okay. And now we get to fight Nessa. Now we get to fight Nessa. Using fossil fuels for real, for real. No, I don't think that's how that works. I think I think the reason it works is because of all the the carbon stuff that get compressed. And I don't, I don't know how energy works. I, I did buy a book to learn about how energy works, and then I never read it. It was like a textbook. It was basically what what I did. Is this is maybe a bit too big brain, but like a lot of universities. We'll have like the syllabus available publicly for their class, or like an old syllabus publicly available. And I've noticed that a lot of professors, they just teach you what's in the book. So like, if you can look at the syllabus and see what the book is, and then buy the book, and then read the book, you basically learned the knowledge you would have learned in the course. I mean, you haven't done the exercises, but like, but like, you just have to buy the book. And then do this, do the stuff, and then you've learned this stuff instead of taking a whole college course on it. Guess I just don't have the energy to read it. Oh my god. <laughs> yes, you're right. You're right. Uh, hi, Shark Bite. It has been a while. How you doing? It's my favorite trainer. Yeah. Best, best girl. 
Pokemon Sword and Shield. <laughs> Okay, let's see how badly this goes. No, it's gonna go great. We're not gonna suffer at all. This is gonna be a nice, easy, smooth win. We got Galissapod. And we have a random number generator. That's <laughs> what so move teams. <laughs> move number one. Uh, let's go. Draining Kiss. Give this bug a little smooch. I <laughs> don't do much. Nessa thinking she's Guzma. Well, this is like Guzma's ace. And Nessa's like, nah, this is my lead. I don't know what that says about Guzma. But it's the saying something. Alright, hyper voice. Okay, he's gonna run away. B is best girl. Okay, fine, fine. But B B's only in sword. She doesn't exist in shield. So like Right Right Uh this thing no smart strike, so that's probably what it's gonna use, so I'm gonna switch out. Uh We should be fine with this. Oh, no, no more sacrifice. We're winning. We're winning without without any aqua ring. That's not smart strike, Nessa. All right, move number two. It does feel wrong to see Nessa with Guzma's signature. I I agree. It is. I don't know if wrong is the word. It just feels weird that that's what she leads with. Uh, you're five minutes behind. I could use Wash Rotom. Uh, well, Rotom's not not usable for this battle, sadly. Because I used it to win the previous battle. Okay. Gonna send out Pelipper. Which means I'm gonna have to switch out. I'm pretty sure it knows a flying type move. Yup, it knows air slash and roost. Uh, we're gonna switch into electric. And then from here, we should just electric sweep, I think. Nope, we're not gonna electric sweep, sweep because he has drill run on the Barracuda. So it's a really bad idea to try to electric sweep because we're gonna get electric swept. Ooh, and I got number one. Discharge. Wonderful. Guzma could have seen Ness use Galissapod in TV and be like, I'm gonna steal that. I like that. That's a good headcanon right there. Okay. Next up, we have Barrascuda. This is a very fast fish. Very fast fish, and it's gonna be using a ground type move. Um, but it's just a water type. Just a water type. What if I brought a grass type? But it, there's a chance I'm gonna U-turn, <laughs> which it would kind of suck if that happens. It, it would it, it would suck just a little bit. If we have to hit that U-turn on round one. Liquidation? It's not even using the strong moves. Alright, random number said number one. Okay, wonderful. Body press. Ice Fang! <laughs> Why? Why does it know Ice Fang? Okay, it's not gonna kill me, right? Right, I'm gonna use drum beating. He's gonna use Ice Fang, but it's not gonna kill me, right? It's not gonna... <laughs> okay, we're good. Flinched! No! <laughs> I can't... I can't believe you've done this! Nessa! Time to use Max Potion. Oh my gosh. Of course, of course Nessa would give me trouble. It does look like a missile, yeah, yeah. 
A missile fish. I think there was like a Yu-Gi-Oh card that was very similar to this. Okay, okay, drum beat him. Surely we won't flinch twice in a row. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, I know somebody called British Noob by chance. I don't think I do. Okay. That leaves her with... The real problem. Dreadnought. Wait. Wait that's not Dreadnought. That's Galissa. <laughs> Hold on. Oh, he knows first impression. Oh. Oh, no. Is... Is she is she gonna troll me and just swords dance? What are the chances the first impression one shots me? <laughs> chances are very high. The first impression just one shots me, so I'm actually gonna have to switch out here. For safety. We do. <laughs> what do we do here? I don't want to die. I don't want to die. <laughs> I don't want my, my, my teammates in the game to die. Um. Shoot. What do I do? I'm panic. I'm panicking for no good reason. I think I, I switch into. A very strong bulky Pokemon. Yeah, we're very strong and very bulky. And you're gonna use first impression that would have just one shot me. But now now it's gone. Now we get to use move number one. Oh oh no. Oh okay, okay. She's not doing that much damage. Gonna use Ice Beam. They should just heal her Galissapod. Am I gonna have to fight this thing after fighting the Dynamax? I'm gonna. <laughs> That's why you like this. That's why. Why, why is she like this, gamers? No! What the heck? No! <laughs> So now he gets to switch out and it's still gonna be there because the, the ability activates so <laughs> she's gonna, she's gonna, I'm gonna be fighting the dreadnought and then I'm gonna be like haha I've won and then she's gonna be like psych I got the Lissa pod still on the team ready to hit you with a first impression oh oh my gosh why? Why you like this, Nessa? Why? <laughs> oh, oh my gosh. And she's gonna have Stealth Rock set up, most likely. Are we weak to Rock? We are weak to Rock. Dang it. <laughs> I don't like it here. Um, this should be our most resistant Pokemon, right? This should be... <laughs> This is doing her job perfectly. I know. I know she is. And I don't like it. <laughs> this is like, I can heal too. And she healed on the right Pokemon as well. Now, Dynamax Felicipod would be interesting. But it would suck because it would just, like swap itself out. I think that's why they don't Dynamax the Felicipod. Okay, Max Rock Ball, gonna set up a Sandstorm. Excuse me? <laughs> why did, why did that, what my health bar? Why did that eat all of it? What is happening? Why? I, I guess I guess she has stab. Uh oh. What health bar? Nessa, don't make me reset, please. <laughs> the 
don't like it. I don't think I bought enough potions. How do I win this? Okay, okay, okay. We, we've stalled the Dynamax. The Dynamax is the <laughs> Oh my gosh. <laughs> no, I'm not wearing gloves. My hands could flip at any moment, but I'd rather them not. Okay. <laughs> Wait, what? Okay, okay. She knows liquidation. <laughs> Jaw. What is jaw lock? I think that's a two turn move. Yeah, prevent switching you out. Um. Um. And then it does 80 damage. It's a dark type move. Okay. So she has two dark type, a rock, and a water. Is this is this the way I go? They're all physical moves. Please, is this bulky? No, we're not bulky. We have negative defense nature. That's great. That's re that's really good. That's really good video game. Um I mean this is supposed to be bulky. We can't get crit. But like This this might be a good switch in. I think I think we go bird. I think bird is the safe switch in. Yeah, we have we have two super effective moves. Just don't knock it out. Just don't just please do not kill it, Nessa. Oh my gosh. Just do not kill the bird. Just do not don't. You wanna use a dark type move. Okay, Rock Tomb works. That's that is that is acceptable. Gosh, how, how much more sandstorm is there? Please be okay. It's almost over. The sandstorm is almost over. We're gonna heal. <laughs> we still have to deal with the Galissa Pot in the end. <laughs> the sandstorm, on the other hand, I know, I know. So here's the question, uh, can we one-shot? I don't know if we're fast enough, first of all, to even attack first. But can we one-shot? <laughs> I don't think we're fast enough. Because we have our speed lowered, right? Okay, so at level 50... This is level 53. The Dreadnought should have around, I don't know, like a hundred speed. And... And we... This is, this is gonna come down to math, isn't it? We have a hundred speed, but it's lower now. <laughs> it's definitely faster than us. Um... So I can't, I cannot attack right now because it, it will kill me. It will instantly just kill me. Um, <laughs> I think we have to sacrifice another Pokemon. <laughs> I don't like it here. We're not fast enough. It, it would one shot us. Uh, unless this magically can like bulk through an attack and have half of its HP left. So if it has over 100 HP left after this move, we're good. It, of course it doesn't have over 100 HP left after this move. Okay, so we're gonna heal the bird. Wait. 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 No! No! I missed click! We're gonna have to. I'm. I'm. I'm gonna have to reset because I. I clicked the wrong button. Yeah, it's gonna kill us. I just wanted to check the stats. Oh my gosh. I. Duck is a sacrifice. No. 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 Cannot sacrifice the duck. 
Ah, I... This is where the game should go. Are you sure you want to send out this Pokemon? Because it's about to die. Man. Man, we were so close. I did save after BD. We were so close, though. And I doofed it up. I doofed it up big time. Man. Man. So, so Lin, when, uh, uh, this is, I have so many, like, challenges and restrictions that at this point we're just trying to see if we can get through the game with them. Even with resets. Because without resets, uh, you, like, this is, like, an impossible challenge, realistically. Um. <laughs> this is more of a, can we even clear the game this way? Which was almost a no, realistically. <laughs> Cause like if I don't reset then she can basically like she just sweeps everything. At least I'm no I, it's not that I'm richer, I'm just less poor than before. There's a difference. <laughs> richer requires to be rich in the first place. The only thing I'm rich in is anxiety. Alright, Galissapod, you're going down, but no you're not. I'm getting destroyed. Okay, okay. Um, we can use any move, I'm just gonna use Hyper Voice. Scared away. Yeah, whoever made Nessa did an excellent job. I, I, I will say that. Surprised they didn't use first impression. Mm -hmm. Yeah, now I know this fish is just gonna be a silly man. But what if I just use try attack? And, and then and then it, it gets destroyed. It did not get destroyed. Okay. So what did I do wrong last time? What did I do wrong last time? Alright, so if we send out this, he's gonna follow up with uh, Pelipper. I'm gonna send out Monkey instead. Everything, oh no. What are you gonna do? Oh my gosh. This is Dad Joke Central again. <laughs> it has Aqua Ring. I am aware. Okay. 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 Move number two. No! <laughs> now move number three, man. Come on. The RNG. The one move. It shouldn't be. Thinking those ice attacks, right? I don't think so. I uh, know those bug type moves though. <laughs> I'm glad we got U turn, I guess. Alright, move number one. Move number one, discharge. Uh oh. We're not gonna flinch, right? Okay, good. good. Okay, seeking. Destroy. No more seeking. Only Sea Queen. Okay, he sends out Barascuda next. Barascuda? <laughs> I hate this guy, he knows ice cream. We're gonna switch out the monkey. Monkey's gonna be like, ha ha, ooh ooh, ha ah, ha, ah. I am monkey. And then we're gonna destroy the, the Barascuda. Okay. Okay. And we've already used the random number, so we can just use normal move. And she's gonna Ice Fang, and we're not gonna flinch. We're not gonna flinch. I'm not gonna flinch, I said critical. Okay. Poo poo poo. Bear Scooter, dead Scooter. No more Bear Scooter. And now. Now, because we have Monkey, she could just send out Galissapod. 
Okay. Okay. And she's gonna first impression, right? She's gonna first. She's not gonna heal. She's gonna first impression here, right? What do I even use against Galissa Bot last time? What did I use against? <laughs> I don't remember. Lapras? Okay. We're gonna we're gonna switch into Lapras. And and she's she's not gonna heal, right? She's not she's not gonna heal it right now. I didn't just switch out like a dummy. Okay. Thank goodness. Alright, now we're gonna random number generate. We get number two, which is ice beam. And we knock it out! Okay, now now the turns have tabled because now she doesn't have Galissapod anymore. Now she's got this bird. Um, this bird knows roost and and and, and will make it rain. Um, uh, <laughs> I'm I'm gonna want to stall out the rain and the tailwind. <laughs> Okay, I don't think this bird is that dangerous, so I'm gonna use this opportunity to heal up both Monkey and Electric Man. That way, that way we can like, if we sacrifice something, we can switch in something else. Okay, yeah, so she's not doing much damage, I can just heal up. And that's a, com a competitive pro, it feels like it. Okay, now just in case, you know, I mean, we could get accidentally crit, so we're gonna we're gonna heal this as well. Okay, so our team is now fully healed, and she only has two Pokemon left, and one of them all can do is is Air Slash. Not that useful, and no longer has Tailwind. Now we can use Ice Beam and Body Slam, and Ice Beam and Body Slam. Uh, never mind. We're good. We were faster. Okay, now she's gonna Dynamax. Oh, and the rain stall. Oh, how the turns have tabled this time in our advantage. Okay. The last time... I don't know if Lapras can... Yeah, we're, we're down to like 40 damage. 40 HP. Realistically, I think I just I heal my way through this. I think that's that's the plan here. We we only have four heals left. I'm sorry, sorry for my changing audio levels. I'm spinning in my spinny chair quite a lot because of uh, the the, the nest of concentrations. Yeah, if he uses the water move, I'm I'm done. Uh, oh, I am Big Turtle Man, and I'm here to use only Rock type move and only Rock type move. Rawr! Oh! <laughs> the nice thing about Lapras is that we have a thing where we cannot get crit hit. So I'm not worried about it. I'm not worried about it. But I, we definitely had to heal because this is definitely less than 40 HP left. Okay. Forest store heals our HP as well, right? <laughs> I'm not about to use something that doesn't heal my HP, right? Okay. Oh. Square health again. Okay, so we have more than 40, but then the the sandstorm. Aurea stores the HP of a single Pokemon and heals any status condition. Okay. Okay, we have we have out healed the Dreadnought. Hope for no crits. Crits are impossible right now. Zero percent chance of crit. 
because of our ability. Okay, now, now it's time for the real deal, right? So this is what I wanted to do last time, which is check summary. That's all I wanted to do. And the game was like, no, instead we're gonna send out the other guy. Okay, so funny enough, our, our bird has a 127, 108, 139. So he's bulkier. Monkey bulky. So we're gonna send out monkey. And we we already had send out monkey, right? Because we did the U-turn. Or was that the previous battle? Guys, did I use monkey this match? Did did I use it this match? That was the previous battle? I did use it this match, okay. So I can just attack with drum beating and we're gonna and we're gonna one shot her and and you'll be fine. And we'll be fine. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yes. That's a I mean she's the real champion, let's be honest. The rest of this game easy. Easy game. Easy. We defeated Nessa. None of the other. I'm kidding. The other guys are also difficult. But Nessa, now we can't use Monkey the next one. That's okay. That's we don't we don't need Monkey. The mo monkey time is no no more. Um. Okay. Monkey. And we didn't have to sacrifice anyone. Let's go. Yay! Okay. The so monkey not usable. Uh, we're gonna be fighting B, who leads with Haulucha, which is once again super effective again. We cannot bring it to battle. Um, she just has a bunch of fighting types. Um, let's see. There's one that has grass type moves and rock type moves and. Fire, grass, rock, fire. Um, none of them have. I think I'm gonna turn it back to like just a light bulb form. Do I want double electric? No, we have we have the the flying right electric fan. That's the flying type. That's gonna be super useful here. Who learned air slash? Let's go. Um, okay, you give sword and shield a hard time. That said, you did like having an elite four. Yeah, I agree. Uh, again, I, I don't, at this point, I don't know how I feel about sword and shield because I've played them so many times that I just have the familiarity bias towards them. Like, I, I've mem memorized these games. Like, I'm gonna be, like, 95, I'm gonna get dementia, start forgetting everything, I'm still gonna remember this game. <laughs> like, that's how ingrained it is in my memory. So many times I've played it. Um. Bum, 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 bum. But I do, I do like having an Elite Four as opposed to... I don't know, I think they try to do too much at the end. They're like trying to overcompensate for stuff. Okay, does this B use any status effects? I don't think so. I'm not seeing status. I mean, Fire Punch could maybe burn me, but like... Eight. We're bringing eight. Okay. Now it's time to fight Ms. B. No status, only fist, exactly. Only punch. One punch? Well, hopefully not one punch. Hopefully we're not gonna get one punch. That would be very unfortunate. 
I do like the tournament format, I just feel like we shouldn't have had a double tournament. Like... Sure, make me fight the rivals or the gym leaders, don't make me fight both. Or have the fights be at, like, different times. I don't know, it just felt extra long, because you basically have, like, three tournament arcs. And it just feels like too many tournament arcs back to back. Because, like, first you gotta beat up the rivals, and then you gotta beat up the other rival, and then the gym leaders. And then you gotta beat up Rose, and only then can you maybe fight Leon, maybe. And I'm like, oh my gosh. That's, that's a lot of steps. It's a lot of steps. I would've quit IR. <laughs> I don't know. Will you remember me after 40 years? I don't know. I don't know if I will. It's kind of sad to think about it, but... I'll probably have vague memories, but not very strong ones. Walking in an armchair. <laughs> Nessa's coming for me! Not the Dreadnought! It's got swift swim, but only in the gym battle. Otherwise, gotta watch out for that Galesa Pond! Guzma! Is that you? Huh, who's Guzma? Probably no Nessa. And, and and then it turns out there is just this, this this poor girl working at the retirement home. She's called Vanessa. And everyone just calls her Nessa. And <laughs> I'm terrified of her. She's like, what the heck? Why is this boomer scared of <laughs> Maybe 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 we should get me no, let's not get me a Nessa figure. The more figures I have, there's a negative correlation between the number of figures I have and the odds of me having a significant <laughs> which is stupid to say but you guys know it's true uh, uh oh you slipped and kicked the wheel of fortune you're going out learn to drive oh wait is this b are you talking as if you're b right now thank you but uh, what the heck i'm scared now i'm scared um okay number two number two hyper voice Almost 40 and been playing since red and blue. Nice. Wait, it missed its... It missed its stack! Get a free knockout! <laughs> there are beautiful souls who love figures. I agree. I agree with that, Brian. It, that, that's why I laugh at it, because I'm like, it's a very general thing to say. It's not necessarily true for every. That is the luckiest thing that could have happened. I agree. The links. All right, if Link, I believe, has a steel type move, right? Nope, nope, just knows Rock Tomb in close combat. Do I just fight him with, with the? I mean, I have Draining Kiss. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna risk it. Because we do normal damage with our normal moves, anyways. No Miku figures, no. <laughs> Wait, Brian, I have trade offer. Take it to Japan and I buy the Miku figure there. <laughs> okay, okay, we're, we're dangerously close to death. So I'm not actually, I'm gonna switch out after this. Yeah, see, they, Matthew, they do that a lot. They're like, here's. Here's this, you know, final end of the game battle, and this trainer only has three moves. That does, they did that for Grusha too. Like two of his Pokemon only have three moves in the end game, like for the rematch. I'm like, what is going on here? Okay, here we're gonna have to switch out. So her Surfetch knows, Leaf Blade Slam, Brick Break, Brutal Swing. Um. Ooh. <laughs> when in doubt. Ooh. Why does that duck no poison jabs? <laughs> if you don't cook it right. If you don't cook it right, you find out. Okay. So I I don't know what happened, but she missed. We got move number one. X. Okay.
slam. We just keep dodging. I mean, I'll take the dodges. This is like the luckiest fight we've had. It has been very lucky. Like, she's been missing moves. One of them just killed half of her team. Not intentionally, but... Alright, she's got grab block next. It... It doesn't... It can't do much. It's a grab block. This is like DJ Octavio, but blue. DJ Blue Tavio. You believe in the Machamp though? I don't know if I believe in the Machamp. Okay, maybe... Maybe I should believe in the Machamp. Because Octolock's gonna drop her physical defenses. Oh my god. Ah. Octolock is such a move. It's the move of all time. He's gonna remix my face. I'm tempted to play the the Calamari Incantation remix. Doesn't drop any spicy wasabi beats. Exactly. <clears throat> okay, I have to switch out. I have to switch out here because because we're gonna who's gonna die? Because we have lowered defenses. Also, I kind of don't want her to land her max cheese strike. Um, how do I discourage her from using fighting techniques? This. This is how I discourage her, right? Because fairies resist fighting, right? Please tell me fairies resist fighting and I don't just do a dumb switch in. Hi hi, yo, it's LED from LED Games. How you doing, Ellie? B is throwing reporting her. Oh no. When you beat the wheel of curses. <laughs> when you break the wheel of curses. Yeah. Okay, okay, let's let's see how it goes. Alright, max flare. Okay, not a fire type move on a water Pokemon. Nah. Nah, not a problem. We got RNG move number one rolled. I'm gonna, I'm gonna attack actually. I'm feeling, I'm feeling lucky today. I might, I might regret it. Uh, gamers, I'm getting a call from a friend. I'm gonna pick up real quick. Sounds like it's important.
Oh, gamers, thank you for being patient with me. Uh, I don't want to tell them I'm streaming right now. Because <laughs> we don't, we don't get to talk often. But anyways, this right hand fight, man, it's, it's not that bad. <laughs> we, we've beaten most of it. Thank you guys for hanging out despite me being quiet. No worries, not like I'm mad or anything. You make it, you make it sound like, you make it sound like you're mad. <laughs> okay, and now, now we're down to his final Pokemon, which... Why, why was this easier when I just wasn't thinking about what was happening? Is that I'm sitting there thinking, hmm, what move do I do? And then that makes me suffer for some reason, but then when I'm not thinking, I'm like, this is easy. Okay, Bird should be okay here. I think we resist most of his moves. Yeah, they're... they were alright. They were alright. Now, are we gonna be alright? That's the real question. Head empty, no thoughts, just... Just push the button and make Dingo explode. Yeah, there we go. They just want to destroy some things. Um, and I had some news to share with them. <laughs> I wasn't gonna be like, oh, just talk to you later. I'm busy. Okay, good. He's not doing much damage. I like that. All right, let's let's get our RNG move here. Number two. Why? Why did why did it have to be number two? <laughs> you know we're gonna waste our useless. Oh no. Oh no. He's gonna buff up his physical attacks. That. Um, by the way, expected delivery Monday? Awesome. Okay, gonna have to heal here. I was gonna say, I can't believe I didn't bring a full heal here. It kinda sucked. Um, I think talking to chat, chat and focusing on the game is a bit too taxing sometimes. And overload. Yeah, probably. Okay, so he did about half. Um, the real problem is that we're gonna have to sacrifice someone again again. What moves does he have? He has Dragon Claw, Body Press, Stone Edge, Iron Head. Okay, so I, can, I cannot send out Wiggly. I cannot send out... Basically the guys that have low HP I cannot send out. Um, I can send out Monkey. I can just heal this guy and knock him out that way. Now imagine when they remake this game, because this thing now has an evolution, they they have him hold an EVO light or something. Oh gosh. I don't like this. <laughs> what is the speed stat on this dude? 85. Which means he has a speed of over a hundred. Has a speed of over a hundred. He's faster than us. He's faster than all of us. Except for Monkey. I think Monkey's the only thing that's faster. But Monkey's gonna hopefully now get one shot. Hopefully they're just done with remakes, I agree. I agree, after BDSP I'm like, you know, I'd rather not have remakes. I could try to use body press, but we're gonna die. I, I did increase the game, no, I did not increase the game volume when I muted myself, no. <laughs> I thought I did. Dragon Claw. 
That does a hundred damage. <sighs> Do I risk monkey? Here's the thing, this, this guy is weak to, to special. So realistically, I need to hit him with like an ice beam. Or an icy wind. Realistically, we're gonna have to sacrifice someone. Um, okay. We're gonna have to use someone who's very weak. And I'm thinking this is the one we use because we're paralyzed here. Sacrifice the monkey? I don't wanna sacrifice the monkey. Oh, it's because my voice is quieter. I'll turn the game down a bit. Oh, gosh, right hand. He's gonna make me have to sacrifice someone. I have two water types, that is true, but like... Basically, I have to have them fully healed before I send them out. Okay, how's this gonna go? Dragon Claw. Yeah, I... Oh, wait. Wait, he's been using Dragon Claw, right? He's been using Dragon Claw, and that's a Dragon type move. So if, I, <laughs> if I switch out to a fairy, it's not gonna get hit, right? I don't think we're fast enough to U-turn, that's the that's the real problem. Now he's gonna use Dragon Claw. That's not Dragon Claw. I hate this game. It's okay, that's that's the one Pokemon I was willing to sacrifice. <laughs> now here's the problem. <laughs> I only have three max potions. If if we go below 120 HP, I'm gonna have to reset. Oh my gosh. Okay. We have two more, we have two more max potions. <laughs> yeah, this is the last battle for today. Worst case, um, we save this battle for next time and I just buy more potions and we have to like heal stall through this fight. Yeah, we, we might have to heal stall through this one, which is where most of our money is going to go. I mean, I could I could try to attack just to gain the knowledge, right? Yeah, he 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 wipes us here. He just completely wipes. I know you guys were saying, hey, use monkey. Let's see let's see if monkey's fast enough to U turn. Wait, this this is just for information. Yeah, how did Stone Edge not miss? I agree. Oh, I guess monkey was fast enough. Yeah, we're gonna have to redo this battle. Um, let's see how much damage he would have taken. We just have to like heal stall through all of his all of his moves. Are we? Yeah, but then we can't hit him. So what I'm gonna do before we hop off is I'm gonna I'm gonna buy a bunch of potions real quick. And then next time we do right hand rose and Leon. I think that's gonna be the plan.
Right hand Rosaleon. Green Miku. It's the game. Oh, can't turn back now. Uh oh. <laughs> well, next stream is gonna be very chaotic. That's for sure. Um. But for now, all I can say is thanks for hanging out, gamers. We we have been soft locked into here. <laughs> We're gonna have to find a way. Yeah, I can't even open the box. Well, <laughs> we're losing guys next time, that's for sure. Well, thanks for hanging out, gamers. Have a good day. Bye.